Hello viewers welcome to our channel. First let's see the finding of the ship Karlsruhe. Karlsruhe is a sunken German World War II warship. The exact location of the Karlsruhe's wreckage had remained a mystery for the past 80 years. Due to the discrepancies in the testimonies given by the captain and crew of the ship and others who witnessed its sinking. The ship was 174 meter light armored cruiser. Was the last of the big German World War II era warships to remain missing, until its wreckage was found on June 30th. The wreckage of the ship, sunk by a British submarine in 1940, was discovered around 11 nautical miles, 20 kilometers, off Christiansand. Going back to the ship history, the Karlsruhe was built in the mid 1920s and commissioned into the German Navy in 1929. It was used mostly as a training vessel until World War II. By the time it was used in battle, its structure and weapon systems had been upgraded several times, making it one of Germany's most effective warships of its class. Now let's see how the ship sank. After dropping off most of its crew, the Karlsruhe turned around to head back to Germany. But it didn't get very far from Christiansand Harbor. Just outside the fjord that leads away from the harbor lurked the British submarine HMS Truant. When it spotted the Karlsruhe emerging from the harbor, the submarine fired multiple torpedoes in its direction, hitting it twice and causing severe damage. The crew attempted to save the ship, trying to navigate it to safety, but gave up after a couple of hours as the seawater rushed in through the broken hull. Everyone in the ship was evacuated to other boats in the fleet and one of those fired two more torpedoes at it to make sure that it sank to the bottom of the sea. That's all viewers we hope this will be helpful for you subscribe our channel for more video like this thank for watching bye.